and respected. Out of the 80 pyramids in ancient Egypt, the Great Pyramid is the largest. It was built in 2560 BC for the pharaoh Khufu. Like all pharaohs, Khufu was more than a king. The Egyptians believed he was the living image of a god come down to earth. The Great Pyramid is the largest stone structure in the world. It dwarfs all comparisons. Nearly as tall as the Washington Monument, five cathedrals can fit within it. Yet it was constructed without machinery or even iron tools. How were the ancient Egyptians able to build it? In the 5th century BC, the Greek historian Herodotus tried to find the answer. He gathered his information from the hearsay of local priests. The account he has left us is unreliable. The pharaoh Khufu compelled his subjects to labor as slaves for his own advantage. Some were forced to drag blocks of stone from the quarries in the Arabian hills to the Nile. The work went on in three monthly shifts, a hundred thousand men in a shift. The wickedness of Khufu is not something that you can regard, in Herodotus' telling at any rate, uh, as something which uh, is hard historical fact. It is anything but that. Herodotus' inaccuracies 